I worked in recruiting for more than 40 years before transitioning into coaching. I prepared people for interviews and many of the ridiculous questions that a person might be asked. I understood that most of the time, all employers wanted to find out is whether or not you're smart enough to lie to them or stupid enough to tell them the truth. Tell me about yourself, like they didn't read your resume before they invited you in for the interview. Tell me about a time when you, another example of something that's on that stupid piece of paper or on the screen. What's funny is there's one question that they ask that I know they don't really care about the answer to and will use to disqualify you, but you need to really know the answer for you. Where do you see yourself five years from now? I know employers don't care about your answer. They're going to do what they do without real concern for your goals or aspirations. They need to do, let me say that again, they need you to do a job. You're qualified or not. It's a checkbox question. But what about you? Where do you see yourself five years from now? Do you have an idea of what you need to know and what experiences you need to have to get there? Most people don't. They're basically riding the conveyor belt to get a job, be onboarded, moved along until they become sufficiently frustrated and either leave or are fired. It's your life, not theirs. You're the chairperson of the board of your own enterprise, and as such, it's stupid to abdicate responsibility to affirm for your success and your happiness. If you need to take courses and they won't pay for it, don't take the freaking job unless you're prepared to write your own checks. And I must continue by saying that assumes that you know where you want to be five years from now and you know you need training. What about if you need to what you need is more of the same experience. I know that may seem dull and stale after a while, but you found out the answer in conversations with other people to know that you're on the right path and you need to persevere. That can make tolerating it for a while easier. Whatever it is, you need to set your compass true north to keep your eye on your career and avoid distractions. Okay, you can set your career GPS in that direction. Okay, but you need to know where you're going to know whether you've gotten there. Where do you see yourself five years from now?